Hey everyone, welcome back to Anxiety Art Adventures. I know all of you are like, what the heck? Why is this diamond painting in our face? I know, I'm shocked myself. No, so this is uh, White Tiger by Diamond Art Club and it is a 20 by 20 inch, which is a 51 by 51 centimeter uh, by Amy Stewart. And this is a partial. Uh, so the only thing that you diamond paint is the actual tiger itself. The background is not diamond painted. Um, this is a square diamond painting. I know you're all like, what is wrong with you, Shug? Um, so I had started this and to be really honest with you, I was really motivated by Mrs. Coffee. She had said, you know, you just haven't found the right square diamond painting yet. And I was like, okay, this is going to be the one. This is going to be the diamond painting that's going to make me like doing squares. Well, guess what? It wasn't the one. <laughs> I got to about here and I quit and I let it sit for, I think it's been about three or four months. And I have another one sitting as well, uh, the Toucan by Diamond Art Club. So what I'm trying to do is get rid of, you know, ones that I've already started. I want to go ahead and quote unquote, slash the stash and finish what I've started. Um, that make, that makes me feel better knowing that things are finished. Um, it's an OCD thing with me and my anxiety starts to get a little heightened when I start to have things collecting that aren't finished. So, um, I decided last week I was going to make it a goal to definitely finish this one and finish the toucan as well. Uh, so I started this on Friday. And remember, I was like, I was right above the eye, right right above the eyes here, I think. Um, I started it on Friday and I got to work on it some Saturday, but my best friend, Sean, came over Saturday and was here quite a while. And honestly, today is Sunday. Um, you won't see this until Tuesday. But um, I worked on this all day today. I mean, all day. I got up at nine, was working on this until five, and I finished it. But that's how long it took me to finish it. So I'm so OCD with squares, like I'll put the squares down and tell me if anyone else is like this. I'll put the squares down, even with my multi-placer, and then I have to go back and I have to move each individual square <laughs> and then move what I've moved to the left or the right of it, and it just, it takes a lot longer for me to do a, um, a square diamond painting. So I personally do not enjoy them, but I was motivated and wanted to go ahead and finish this so I can say it's finished. Um, I'm giving this as a gift to my friend Sean. Um, yeah, and it's beautiful. It turned out gorgeous. I don't know if you guys can see this, but it like, let me do it from this side. It is just so sparkly. It's got a bunch of ABs, a lot of white ABs in it. Um, it's, it's so pretty. It's gorgeous. But I was like, oh yeah, a, a partial square. This isn't going to take me a long time. <laughs> was I wrong? Was I wrong? And Mrs. Coffee, I love you, Shug, and I tried really hard, but this one didn't do it for me. <laughs> so I'm still not a fan of squares. But anyway, so uh, let's do a post review of this. But before I do that, um, I do want to give a shout out to one of my very, very good friends um, in the community. You all know her as Melody. Melody has started a new YouTube channel and I'm so proud of her and I can't wait to see her very first video when it comes up. It, will, it might be up by the time you see this, but please go check her out and give her some love and I'm going to have her link down below. Her channel name is Melody Loves Her Hobbies. Loves is spelled L-U-V-S. Uh, Melody loves her hobby, so please go check her out. Many of you know Melody, and she has always been a wonderful supporter of um, the uh, YouTube community. And she was on Instagram and Facebook, and she's just she's just such a wonderful, genuine person. So check her out. Okay, um, okay, let's go over the canvas. So, like I said, it's a partial, so you're not doing any of the background. You're only doing the tiger. Uh, this had 16 colors, so there were not a lot of colors. There was a lot of grays and blues and like um, like the white ABs. And then, you know, a little bit of orange here and a little bit of blue and green in the eyes. Um, I think this is a fabulous 
I think Diamond Art Club did a fabulous job charting this image. Um, I know a lot of people complained about the whiskers, but you know what? It's it's a diamond painting. There's no way they're going to actually be able to have a real curve on the whiskers because it's, you know, it's in blocks. It's going to be impossible. I think it's great. I think it's fabulous. Um, I had no problems with the canvas. The canvas was super sticky. I haven't had any drills popping. Um, even after it sat for three months, I have not sealed it. Um, haven't had any problems with that. So it's just great. I have not had any issues with Diamond Art Club, as I've said so many times before. I know a lot of people have, but um, I have not. So uh, yeah, I had plenty of drills. Here, I'll show you. Uh, these are all my drills and I had, I mean, plenty left over. Even the ones that I only used for the eye. I mean, that's a lot of drills left over just for, you know, the two aqua eyes. And then this was for the nose. Still had plenty of drills. This one, I mean, a little low, but I still had enough. So plenty of drills left over. Didn't run out of drills. Um, I'll show you the trash. And like I said before, all diamond paintings have are gonna have trash drills. I don't care where you get it from, uh, whether it's a really high end company or if it's you know AliExpress. Um, you're gonna have trash no matter what you, no matter where you get it from. So this is the trash I had, which honestly I don't think this was too bad for the size of the painting. Um, there were some big long pieces in there which. I don't get very often, but you know, what else? As long as I have enough drills to finish the canvas, I don't care. That's all I care about. Okay, so that's the trash. Um, I did check uh, earlier, and this canvas is available on Diamond Art Club's website for $39.99. It says you can add it to your cart. Uh, so if you want this diamond painting, uh, by all means, go and get it. It's, it's fabulous. So I will have the link down below for this kit. Um, I'll put the link down below for Melody's um, YouTube channel. So hopefully you can go and subscribe to her and give her some love. But yeah, so Diamond Art Club, White Tiger by Amy Stewart. Uh, fabulous. Fabulous. Again, uh, am I going to do another square? Mm, probably not. But you never know. Um, you never know. If I find something that absolutely, you know, calls to me that I have to get done, I'll give it a shot. I, I'm, I'm willing to give it a shot for another square diamond painting. Um, like I said, I do have another square one that needs to be finished. It's, it's, the, it's the one from Diamond Art Club. It's like the beautiful bridge, I think it's called. And it's like a pier that goes out into the middle of really pretty blue water. That one's square, and I've had that one for a long time um, that I was working on for my husband. It was going to be uh, what hung in his office at work, but you know what? He hasn't been to work in, what, five months at the office, so no rush on that one, Shug. Uh, yeah, so that one's left, and then the two cans from Time and Art Club. Those are the only two I have open, and I, I really need to get them done because of my OCD and my anxiety gets... A little heightened when I have things that I haven't finished. So I need to get those finished. I did kit up, um, I think it's called Oaked and Aged by Diamond Art Club. That's going to be a gift to my mom. She already knows about it. Um, because as far as I'm concerned, if, if I'm going to spend the time to do something like that, I kind of want to know if you like it. Because if you don't like it, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> so I showed it to her and she absolutely loved it and wants it. So, you know, it's the one that says wine a little laugh a lot that one love that image so yeah and then after that i think i'm going to work on some mystical diamond art i've got like i said i've got a lot of diamond paintings that i've got um waiting to come in um from a bunch of different companies and um i did just order the war pony from diamond art club super excited about that one uh that one has some sentimental value to me because it reminds me of my horse uh that i lost um last year so yeah so gonna be busy 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 but yeah this one was not as bad as I thought to work on but um, 
a lot of confetti. I mean, there were a lot of different, I know you can't tell by looking at it, but there were a lot of um, different colored grays in here and a lot of different colored blues. So I was constantly having to change colors, which I'm okay with it, with the confetti here and there, but all the time, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. So anyway, this is White Tiger by Diamond Art Club. Like I said, I'll have the link down below. Please let me know in the comments below if anybody has this diamond painting. Have you done it? Uh, what did you think about it? Um, would you do this diamond painting? Uh, let me know in the comments down below. It is available, so I will put that link down there. Um, and y'all, shh. Did y'all look up here? Look up here. They're sleeping. They're still sleeping. Oh my gosh. They're still sleeping. This is like unheard of. It's amazing. Oh, driving me crazy, y'all. <laughs> driving me crazy. This is, this is how my day goes. So I get up, make sure they're taken care of, you know, litter box, food, all that stuff, water. And then they have like a good NASCAR run through the house for about 20 minutes. They just do laps around the house, run into things, that kind of thing. And then, um, you know, they usually take a nap like around lunchtime. Um, then they get up, you know, right, right before you know, right three, four o'clock and they've got a WWE and like fight each other and wrestle and slam into things and get into things. And then at dinner time, they want to, you know, mess with us while we eat, of course. And then after dinner, they sleep. They generally sleep, um, until about 10 o'clock or so. Um, but it is now it's almost midnight here and they're still asleep. So usually they get up around 10 or 11 and then they are just crazy wild until like 2 3 a.m it's insane it's insane so that's my life <laughs> anyway not that y'all wanted to hear that but yeah so there it is uh, i'm proud of myself for finishing it and i'm happy that i did it um i don't think i'm I'm not going to consciously order another square unless, like I said, unless I see something, an image that I just absolutely have to have in a square. I'm just not. I like rounds. I like that I can go through rounds faster. Um, I'm not constantly having to straighten them and line them up. Just personal preference. But anyway, uh, like I said, I think Diamond Art Club did a fabulous job um, charting this image. I think it looks great. And... Uh, anybody that likes squares should definitely give it a shot because it is available. $39.99 on their site. Check it out. All right. I'm going to go because it's midnight and I probably need to um, get ready for bed because I'm going to get up early and start working on some diamond painting. So I hope everybody has a fabulous night. Um, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you know when I um, put up a video. And to my patrons, thank you so much for your support and your continuing support. Um, you you guys have really been the motivation for me to keep going uh, with YouTube and uh, doing videos and things like that. So I love all of you very much. Thank you again. And I will see you again really soon. Bye, guys.